Mass demonstrations are being held across Romania, where tens of thousands of people are protesting against corruption and low wages. In the capital, Bucharest, police have clashed with protesters as they demand that the government stand down. Tiffany Worthma reports. In the centre of Bucharest, right out the front of the city's government building, this crowd demands change. The protesters want the governing Social Democrat Party to resign, angry that it sacked an anti-corruption prosecutor whose work was highly effective. Scuffles broke out between protesters and the police. Some demonstrators threw bottles and tried to break through barricades. Police fired back with tear gas and water cannon. More than 100 people on both sides have needed medical treatment. Many of these protesters are Romanians living abroad, but who have returned home to join the rally, wanting an end to the country's corruption, low wages, poor living standards, and the government's interference in the justice system. Since the Social Democrat Party came into power last year, it's tried to decriminalise several corruption offences. Hundreds of thousands of people have signed a petition demanding a law that would ban anyone charged with corruption from running for office. According to the World Bank, there are between three to five million Romanians working and living abroad, where there are more opportunities and more money. Tiffany Werdema, BBC News.